You know, they bring you into the match just yeah. so heavily. Right, right, absolutely. Um, and then we're seeing a little bit of switch right here too. Actually, Mortal Clutch going with a little bit of Thunder Wave here. Both of these characters got teleports available. Um, and I've seen, I've been seeing a lot more Raiden. Uh, really solid character. He's got some good reach, I think, to contest with Scarlet. They can kind of play the same oh, game. For sure. I I don't know if I would have picked Thunder Wave though. Mm -hmm. uh, being mm -hmm. his staff is a, is a little bit more of a reach here, but right. he looks to be doing pretty well. He's got corner positioning, health lead, nice grabs, get him great positioning to end the round here. Yeah, a little quick first round here for uh, for Mortal Kush. Oh, yeah. Funny Neutral. thing too is before this tournament even started, I actually ran into a Raiden. So, oh, uh, did you? Oh, so, so you're ready to know what's there. going on. Yeah. Oh, definitely, definitely. And now I really like the uh, I really like the flawless block punish that Mortal Kush doing, establishing early that he's not going to be standing for those uh, for those stagger shenanigans. Oh, definitely. I've definitely found out over time too that crushing blows are certainly a lot harder, a lot more prestigious for for those you know high tier players. Mm -hmm. Right. Put that higher up. Oh, for sure. Nice throw counter here from uh, Immortal here. Mm -hmm. Good corner pressure. Nice grab. I like that from Slink. Okay. Good little scary get in, the in his mind a little bit here. But you know, here's the thing. Like Slink wanted to get him in the corner right there. Immortal Kush doing a great job of just exiting the corner immediately. Did not want any part of that corner pressure from Slink. Going to stay full oh, screen here. And, that's... Ooh, and that, that just tool of, of creating it which position you want that teleport with Raiden to go is just is a very nice extra added tool for him. Yeah, that was a respectable attempt from Mortal Kush to teleport in. He just barely whiffed that. I believe it's forward too. Um. I believe, I th actually, I think it might be that forward one. I think it's forward oh, okay. one two. For the, oh, okay, okay. Uh, that. That one right there. Oh, that's actually back one too. And then he did the tick throw back off of it right there. Yeah. Yep. That's a that's a great tool. Oh, definitely. I've, I'm not gonna be completely honest. I've been caught by that for a, by a few raidens now. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Okay, here we go. Four, uh, three, two. A little overhead ender. Perfect nice duck. duck. Love that punish. Yeah. A little easy three oh six. Not no big deal. Oh, beautiful read by Slink on that teleport. Yeah, I mean, actually, Slink was doing. Slink uh, knew at that point that uh, Mortal Kush was waking up, teleporting pretty much every time right there. He was totally ready for the punish. Where we go here in this game number two, we'll see if Mortal Kush is going to be able to adapt, or if maybe he's going to pull out that collector a little bit later too. Round one. Yep, looks like he's going back to the raid. I didn't think he did. I didn't think he did too bad. But, uh, no. Little mistakes here and there, but. Yeah. Definitely a good little pick for him. I think so. Alright, Slink. Getting a little damage done here. A little damage. That meter burn blood thing on my trigger, 27%. Uh, <laughs> unbreakable. Oh my gosh. That is scary. Oh, see, you gotta, I still gotta get used to that, you know, the, the justice not being the same kind of health here in MK11. Yeah. Right, yeah, yeah, for sure. Beautiful positioning here by... Oh, but that... I, oof, tough little wake up from Slink here. Mm -hmm. Being able to keep that first round, but he's still in the corner. So, we're all keeping corner position here. Nice little down one stagger from both players. Oh, I like that. Poor grab, he's going to keep the corner advantage. Slink going to turn it around on him, though. Oh, oh my beautiful God. interruption. So clean. Oh, but drop the combo. Oh, we're staggering. Drop oh, it. another drop. It's very uncharacteristic by Slink here to be dropping these combos, especially so late into the tournament. Sure, yeah. I mean, this is a relatively new character that he's picked up here with, with, uh, with Scarlet, so he may just be learning those little minute... Uh, Little little ranges. Oh, Mortal Kush getting nice another round. Nice little end rounding here combo. Yeah. 
fight. Ooh, I like that. Nice little pressure from Mortal. Big board grab, grab. and blow. Break all the bones in Scarlet's face. You're gonna need a nose drop after that. Okay, flawless block up too. Mortal looking promising right now in this third round here, but Slink just saying, I don't know about this, man. Gotta keep you in the corner. You gotta keep this momentum right here. Oh man, perfect timing to teleport uh, when Slink was trying to Beautiful jump in. Beautiful read. I love that read from Mortal, just knowing when Slink is just ready to get out of that corner. Wow, look uh, at that. Mortal taking game two here. Man, you love to see it, all right? We've got a match here. Definitely, I definitely uh, agree with that That Raiden pick. He, he definitely knew he had the ability to adapt and adjust, and you really just get that that sense of, like, needing a backup character. But with Mortal Kombat, you know, you with a lot of these Mortal Kombat players especially going from back into you know the mk9 days where sonic had just started off his, his fighting career and look where he is now he's you know one of the top players in the scene yeah absolutely and then i mean you know and i mean look at the organization that's uh that's you know running this tournament today you know cr that's actually sonic fox's old team you know that he was a part of with um oh. with uh honeybee actually was on cr2 i believe uh yes actually it was honeybee uh i believe um biohazard as well nice and i think we had um i can't remember his name uh he played scarecrow in injustice 2. um oh boy white boy oh he yeah had white boy yeah, as yeah. well that was actually uh that was actually one of the most epic moments of injustice 2 right when the uh, game first came out we had white boy win uh win that tournament Scarecrow. Which was oh yeah, that cool. was that oh, was man. certainly one of Sierra's biggest moments. Big stagger into the parry right here. Slink gonna get this corner control on point restand off the interactable right here. I don't know about that that down one uh, option selector. I think that we yeah. could definitely have done a lot more there. Sure. Yeah. Nice little pressure here coming from Mortal. Oh, wow. Nice combo. So open it up. Oh, little man. OS here. Beautiful bait. One storm cell too many. And, uh, blood for blood. That's going to be Slink little... tying it up here. Final round. Oh, yeah. Got a little oh. punish for his ways here. How did I forget about CR? How did I forget about Dragon, who was also in CR? Thank you, Lord Noodles. Yeah, yeah, Dragon was oh, also man. in CR. That was, that was, that's pretty epic, man. The CR was running it, man. For the longest time. Oh, definitely. Yeah, honestly, I I didn't even remember he was in CR. That was yeah. Uh, wow. I think he was probably one of the one of the first to leave. Maybe more Sonic, if not at the same time as Sonic. Right, right. Slink taking a very very promising lead so far in this in, uh, in this third game. Here. It is nice grab right there. It goes unteched. Mortal Kush doing a great job teleport of teleporting out. out. He's got something right here. He, he needs something. He's just got to get a little, oh, little oh, poke. Oh, oh, oh man. If only he would just... If he just amplified... Uh, where spacing is just oh, yeah. crucial. You don't have like... A, it's not like MKX where you have the run button. You could just stay stay up on your opponent. Um, oh, definitely. Too. And especially with, you know, the these fighting games, they're such a mental game. You get that, that one special time when you get into your opponent's head and then all of a sudden you just you take control. Right, yeah, exactly. It looks like uh, Mortal's just not having it with, with Slink right now. He's just putting, putting the metal to the metal right now. Honestly, though, I think Mortal's uh, doing a pretty good job here. That was a beautiful flawless block. Uh, uh, from from Slink, but Mortal, you know, I mean, he's, he's doing a really good job here. I mean, I've been impressed with his gameplay. I, I, haven't, I haven't seen him play a ton, but I mean, it's just it's just cool to see a player, you know, going toe to toe with Slink uh, in this way. Well, oh, definitely. This is actually for me personally the first time I've seen both of these players play. Oh wow! Okay. Mortal's Mortal is definitely a. Uh, Keeping me impressed right now. Slink is a, yeah, typically known for uh, known for the Sindel play actually. Also, 
Yeah, that's uh, that's honestly has been from what I'm hearing from. Him. Yeah. Not even just from his own teammate, uh, accurate, but also from people outside of his, his team. It's a this is a newer pick with Scarlet, but um, I think Slink feels very bullish on this character. You know, just feels like you know um, she covers uh, she covers some things. Um, he does well in this game, so that's I think that's cool. Oh yeah, and he's definitely playing like it too. Definitely, uh, yeah, you know, showing that his Scarlet is uh, is up to par with a lot of these players in, in the FCC. Here. Took a risk with that double kick, but it's got that nasty flawless walk at the end of it. Mortal Cook is gonna definitely take advantage of that. Uh, okay, so he's definitely gonna have to wait till point. that next round. To, to do yeah. That there. Ooh, that was a big whiff punish here. Uh-oh. Making and Mortal feel the pain here. And just like that, you know, the, a quarter of your life is gone. Off of that one, oh, off of that one move. Absolutely. One mistake in this game is just devastating. It really is. Oh, just my God. like that Mortal right bringing the pain right back to him. Yes, he, he needs this, though. Oh, my God. Nice low to counter back the, uh, the parry. Nice little ender. Ooh, beautiful OS, but Slink going ahead of time here. Space it. Okay. Oh, tried to go for the tick that throw. Pressure, oh, beautiful no. Read. Oh, and then there's the... There's the cancel into the fatal blow. I think this might kill. I actually, oh, I think really? he's alive. He's got something. He's got, a, he's got one chance. One check. One check. Oh, my gosh. Oh, no. Damn. Once again, Slink is not hesitating to just wake up with some buttons, man. Just waking up and then seizing that opportunity. Here we go, Slink oh, with absolutely. the, uh, we're gonna take that, uh, that art class yet again, bust out the wine. 